Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you make a mock-up which is very simple and realistic and minimal. So let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. So here are going to the file and taking new options. At first I'll take an artboard which is 2560 and 1440 and 300 pixel per inch RGB color and 8 bit and hit the create button. And now after that going to the file and place embedded options and I downloaded a couple of images from there I'll import a leaf image which is I download from the unsplash.com and making it bigger like that fit with the skin like this and hit the tweak button and after that we'll draw something which is really like the phone or iPhone like that so here right press and making it restylize the layer and after that right press and convert to a smart object so this one is the base and you can use that thing that means the smart object as a new things i'll show you how to work with that and then here adjustment layer and going to the solid color taking dark type color and then the opposite will be 12 percent okay that's fine make this one copy by pressing ctrl command j and making it into upper layer of the all layers okay i'm turning off that and these two things is base making these two things in a group base or background or bg whatever it is bg is good for me okay now here just mark it as a red one and after that i'll turn it on and then upper side of this layer i'll make or draw a rectangle like this so like this so in this portion i'll change the round up like that i'll change more round make sure this one is like uh, linked up and here this one is the properties options going to the window and you will find out the properties option if you don't find out over there or in future if you want to find it out and after that stroke mode i'll make this one white and fill mode i'll turn it off okay fine and from here i'll make the thickness of the border seven is good for me okay that's good and press controller command t make this one more like this yeah that's fine so here you can draw another one like um, here the round rectangle and the notch actually and turn off the stroke in this case and give the fill color like this it will match with that and yeah that's fine Press Ctrl or Command T, you can make it more bigger. Press the Shift and hold it and make it bigger. The big type notch. And here we'll use the fingerprint. So going to the file and place embedded options, I downloaded a PNG. You can use that or you can use from any kind of sources or you can download from flat icon. I'll provide you the icon download link in my video description. And from here, I'll make this one into blending options, making the color here the color overlay white and hit ok that's good so i need to change the round one more round going to the properties again and making this one more round yeah that's fine now this is good and in this case i'll use a fill color so going to the fill color like this trying to different fill color okay that's good and taking this base into upper side of the base and the phone so here the roundup of the notch and this one is fingerprint as it is right press and create clipping mask okay fine so you're getting the new things and the smart object what is like that or what is the purpose of using the smart object double press over here file place embedded i'll replace another photo instead of that photo i'll fit with this save it out place and save it and it will save in this window and in this case i'll increase the opacity like this so you are getting like that i'm going to the back actually and the other thing is the shadow this portion that means the phone portion going to the blending options going to the drop shadow so here if i give the drop shadow like this this one is good this one is good 
I'll make this one into more like that. So this and adjust the shadow like this. Yeah, that's good. And don't spread it too much. Yeah, on is good. And normal mode and like that. So it will make the dimension. So now I'll change this one. So saving it out. Okay. Newly we have to place. Don't save this one. And here if I go to the base or any kind of things. I'm giving the phone. One of them you can change it out. I'm giving the rate one. That means if I change this one. Suppose going to the file and place embedded. From here. Suppose this type of color. If I provide over here. And save it out. It will save over here. And in this case you can increase the opacity. So it will make the dimension. The drop and everything. Let's change it up. Again, going to the file and place embedded options. Uh, different type of images like forest. And save it out. Here you are getting the mock up like smartly. So, another thing, suppose going to the file and place embedded options. Here, another things. This one. Okay, making it bigger. Saving it out. And these kind of things so you can put text over here you can give any kind of things over there so i'm going to the back like that so here i'm making group and this one is phone phone part so giving this one orange and upper side of this i'll put the text for the dimension or for the fulfill of this work You are getting the mock up like this which is really nice. You don't have to go anywhere. You can make yourself or your own mock up. Sometimes you can uh, just give any kind of color. Suppose I want to pick color from here. I want to give color like this or this. Whatever you can do by using this technique. So hope that you learned a lot from this video. If you did, please thumbs up and share with your friend. And if you have any kind of question, query, request, please do comment on my video comment section. Until the next video, I'm ASMR signing out. Stay safe, stay at home, keep me in your prayers. Bye-bye.